What's going on everybody? Welcome to the Average Guys Gourmet. As usual, I'm Tony Rican, and today I've got a really cool, really simple little lunch or dinner, whatever you want to serve it as. This thing is so awesome, I know you're going to love it. We're going to make some Greek style quesadillas. So let's just go ahead and get started and jump right into these. Greek quesadillas, you're going to want to start by preheating your oven to 400 degrees. Now I'm going to start working on my sauce. I'm going to attempt to say it right. If I say it wrong, I apologize. Tzatziki sauce. I think I got that. But anyways, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and take my plain Greek yogurt. I'm going to finely dice one cucumber, add that in. Dice up a couple cloves of garlic. Then I'm going to go ahead and zest a little bit of lemon and add that in. Then add the juice from that lemon. And dice up about a tablespoonish of dill. Then about a teaspoon's worth of fresh mint. Then a couple of tablespoons of olive oil. Then I'll mix this all together and I'll let it sit in the refrigerator for about 10 minutes so those flavors can blend nicely. Now that that awesome Greek tzatziki sauce is sitting in my fridge chilling, we're ready to move on to the tortillas themselves. Now I've got them laid out on a pan. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take a little bit of that spinach and place it on each one. I'm going to add my sun-dried tomatoes, my chopped Kalamata olives, then my mozzarella and my feta cheese. Then I'm just going to go ahead and place another tortilla on top of each one. We're going to go ahead and pop this in the oven for about 8 to 10 minutes. So these tortillas brown nicely and that cheese melts all the way. So that was it. 10 minutes in the oven and these were done. Once they came out, I went ahead and cut them up, sprinkled a little extra dill over the top for that little added flavor, and now they're ready to serve. Just take a look at these. They look amazing. These tortillas are nice and crispy. That sauce came out great. But you know what? We can't just look at these. We got to go ahead and grab one and just dig right in. Mmm. This is so, so good. You guys are going to love this one. So go ahead and like, share, subscribe. Give this one a try, and we'll see you guys next time. 